Hi there guys, I'm Nikhil from Greedy Tech and this is a speed test between Moto G5 and the Redmi 4A. These are the benchmark scores. Now I'll start the speed test where I open the same set of apps on both the phones at once and you can see which phone opens them faster. By the way, both the phones are connected to the same Wi-Fi network. I personally think this is the best way to test the speed because I'm opening the same app on both the phones at once in very similar conditions. If you think I need to change something about the speed test, do let me know, I'll try to include them. Now let's see how both the phones perform. Purely in terms of benchmark scores, there isn't a huge difference between both the phones. G5 has 8 core CPU and Redmi 4A has a 4 core CPU. More number of cores is always better, but it doesn't always mean it's more powerful. With that said, in this case, Moto G5 has the better CPU. More number of cores will help in better multitasking and it's good for power efficiency. In the speed test, Moto G5 was faster than Redmi 4A. Obviously G5 has better CPU, but more than that, it has stock Android and that makes it much faster than a heavily skinned phone like Redmi 4A. Now let's see which apps are still in memory. Moto G5 has 3GB of RAM and Redmi 4A has 2GB of RAM. It's just like what you think. G5 will do a better job because of the additional RAM. Moto G5 with 3GB of RAM should have been able to hold all the apps in memory, but it didn't. G5 is the winner in this round, but it could have done better. So guys, that's pretty much it for this video. What's your take on the speed test? Do let me know by commenting below this video and if you like this video, hit that like button and subscribe to our channel to see more cool videos on tech. I'm Nikhil from Greedy Tech signing off. Have a nice day.